Hey guys, welcome back. I hope you're doing good this evening and I hope everything's going well for you. Well today, I'm going to show you some nitrogen deficiency that I had in my peppers. I'm going to show you what they look like when I planted them. I'm going to show you what they look like today. I'm going to tell you and show you exactly what I did to fix this nitrogen deficiency. We're going to go over it. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. Now, in my last video, I talked about excessive nitrogen in my tomatoes. Well, here's what happened. I was looking for some pepperoncinis, and I went two or three places. I couldn't find any, so I bought some cabanellas, uh, cabanella peppers, and they're close to a pepperoncini, so I bought them. They were kind of yellow when I got them. I didn't think they were that bad, but when I got them home and started planting them, they, they looked pretty rough. So guys, what happens when you have nitrogen deficiency is the leaves at the bottom are going to turn yellow. The plant's going to be stunted, which mine were. I've got a couple pictures. I'm going to put them in right here. You can see what they look like when I planted them. And guys what happens is the leaves turn yellow at the bottom because all the nitrogen that the plant has it's going to take it up to the top hoping the sun hits it where it can grow so uh, it's not going to grow because it just doesn't have enough nitrogen that's why it's stunted so I planted them and for probably the last two and a half weeks I've been working on these and so what I did was is I steeped some rabbit manure and I had some alfalfa pellets mixed in with it and I've been putting it on my plants. Now, if you don't have rabbit manure, don't worry about it. You can use just alfalfa pellets. Alfalfa pellets like you would feed a rabbit are great. You know, they got a lot of nitrogen in them. They're a slow release nitrogen, so they're going to work for a long time. Now the reason why I kind of like uh, rabbit manure is rabbit manure draws earthworms. And so if you have clay soil, them earthworms are going to aerate your, your soil. You know, they're going to leave worm castings, which is probably the best fertilizer ever. And so I do like using the rabbit manure. But if you don't have any, guys, don't worry about it. You know, this will still work, okay? Now I'm going to show you... Um, what they look like today and then I'm going to show you exactly how I've been fertilizing these things so hold on just a second okay so you can tell they're a lot greener and they still don't have a lot of size but they really do look a lot better now I have a couple down here <clears throat> that still have some yellow on them and I'm going to show you exactly what I'm doing I do mix my uh, rabbit manure I steep it pretty strong I don't put a lot on like I don't do it every day every other day I put on you know a really strong batch of it and then I'll wait three or four days. So all in all in this two and a half weeks, I've put it on maybe three to four times. So let me show you. This one here still has, still has some uh, yellow to it. So this is what I'm going to do. See how dark that is? I want it, I want it, you know, kind of heavy on the nitrogen, but that's about how much I'm going to put on, and I'm going to wait three or four days, let that do its thing, and then I'm going to come out and check it again. <clears throat> Guys, in my opinion, it has really worked good. Uh, it's cheap, it's easy, anybody can do it, and... They haven't really grown a lot in size, but I do have a couple over here that have little bitty peppers on them. Now what I'm going to do there is, is I'm going to take those peppers off because I want the plant spending all of its energy getting bigger and not trying to grow peppers. So I'll keep you guys updated. I, I really want these cabanellas. I've never grown them before. 
uh, but I want to can some of them, so I really hope it works out good. Well, guys, that's the video. You have a good night, and I'll talk to you later. See ya.